Well, tips from the public helped lead to an arrest following a hit and run that killed a North Minneapolis woman. 37 year old Aisha Frills was killed as she tried to cross Lindell Avenue to get into a cab on New Year's Eve. She was heading out to an event with friends. Reg Chapman has more from the family trying to comfort the four children she left behind. The memorial outside Aisha Frills' home on Lindell Avenue is overflowing. While people drop off stuffed animals and balloons, her family is busy planning a funeral. Picking out caskets. Just that whole, whole process just brings it all back. Jarrell Frill says emotions are high, especially after Minneapolis police announced the arrest of a person connected to the car involved in the hit and run that took a sister's life. The person's name has not been officially released, but the family is familiar with the person now in custody and waiting to be charged. We didn't know him. We knew somebody that knew somebody that knew him. So, Minneapolis police say tips to a hotline and Crime Stoppers helped investigators find the car involved. Then they questioned a person connected to that car and eventually placed her under arrest. So having that closure, that's that's a, that's huge. It's nothing compared to having my sister back, not at all. But having that closure, that's that's huge. Now the focus is on Aisha's four children, ages 16, 9, 6, and 4. They're at my house right now with my wife. She's taking care of them. She's been a huge support for me and my family, just like everybody. Everybody's been a huge support. Like, my sister was loved by so many. Darrell hopes the community that loved his sister so much comes together to help the children she leaves behind. My whole family's thankful for all the love and support that we're getting. But it, these four kids is gonna, we, it's, it's gonna take a village. Now, the Hennepin County attorney has until noon tomorrow to file charges against the woman being held in connection with that hit and run accident. The family has started a fund to help Aisha's four children. If you would like to help, we have a link to that fund on our website at WCCO.com slash links, Amelia. All right, Reg, thank you.